हेलो चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू अनदर सेशन ऑफ साइंस क्लास फोर टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड लेसन नाइन एनिमल्स एंड द यंग वंस एंड विल सॉल्व एक्सरसाइज ऑफ लेसन नाइन दिस लेसन विल हेल्प यू टू आइडेंटिफाई एंड लर्न अबाउट एग लिंग एनिमल्स एंड लाइफ साइकल्स ऑफ हैन frog and butterfly let's understand about egg laying animals many animals reproduce by laying eggs the eggs are either kept in a warm place or the parent animal sits on them to keep the eggs warm once the eggs mature the young ones hatch out animals that lay eggs include birds frog fish turtle lizard crocodile snake cockroach butterfly bee mosquito and grasshopper and birds are warm blooded animals and they also lay eggs now let's understand about birds all birds reproduce by laying eggs most birds build nest on trees to lay their eggs and to raise their young ones the main characteristic of a bird is feather no other animal has feather other important feature for birds are wings and hollow bones birds also lay eggs like reptile however they are warm blooded like mammals birds fly by flapping their wings and using air pressure to create lift under their wings just like aeroplane although an important characteristic of most of the birds is flying but not all the birds can fly some birds that don't fly are penguin kiwis and ostrich penguins actually spend a good portion of time in the water where they are swimmer now let's understand about parts of a bird's egg an egg has a thin protective shell called the egg shell within the egg shell is a white jelly like substance called the albumen which is rich in protein the yellow inner part of the egg is the yolk and it is rich in fats vitamins and minerals the yolk contains food for the growing baby or embryo which further develop into a chick within the egg the embryo goes through various stages of development before the egg hatches and the chick comes out the chick then grows into an adult various stages of development from an embryo to a mature adult is called the life cycle of animal so now let's see life cycle of egg laying animals life cycle is a series of changes that happens to all living things every life cycle is the same for every generation for instance a fly's life cycle begins at a fertilized egg the 
egg develops into a fly which grows until it fertilizes an egg or lays a fertilized egg of its own so the life cycle then begins again with the new fertilized egg so life cycle means the stages a living thing goes through during its life in some cases the process is slow and the changes are gradual so all organisms go through stages of development and egg is first in the chicken life cycle do you enjoy scramble egg for breakfast or have you used eggs in a recipe if so you can thank a hen for those eggs hens are female chickens and they are found on farms throughout the world in fact there are more chickens on the planet than any other birds and like other animals hens also go through stages called a life cycle hens lay no more than one egg per day as the process of laying an egg is governed by the presence of sunlight or warmth in fact in winter month due to the lack of natural light even fewer eggs are laid during this time of the year next stage is hatching eggs so all hen begin their lives inside of egg shell once an egg is laid one of two thing can happen if the egg is not fertilized it makes it way to the grocery store and these are the eggs you enjoy for breakfast and if the egg is fertilized then it takes about 3 week for the baby inside to be strong enough to hatch out of it even when the hen sits on the egg she heats the egg to 100 degree fahrenheit to 101 degree fahrenheit the hen turns the egg on a regular basis by using her beak to scoop under the egg and roll it towards her so once the embryo within the egg has developed into a chick the chick breaks the shell to come out and this process is called hatching then the young chick then grows up to become an adult hen now let's understand life cycle of a frog a frog lays eggs in water in large cluster depending on the species of frog the mother can lay a handful or as many as 20000 eggs at a time while the eggs are usually laid in or near water a few in the rainforest lay their eggs in the tree so the embryos will drop into the water as they hatch and after the mother lays her clumps of eggs gradually it fertilizes it takes eggs of frog roughly 3 weeks to hatch after laying when baby frog first 
emerge from the egg usually 1 to 3 weeks after the eggs are laid the tadpole live more like fish than adult frog since they have gills that allow them to breathe under water and they spend their days eating plants once the frog leaves the body of water it is an adult frog it will breathe exclusively with its lung and begin to eat insect instead of plant frog life spans vary based on the types but they usually spend a few year growing to their full size before laying more eggs and beginning the cycle again now let's understand life cycle of butterfly butterflies have four life stages the egg the larva means caterpillar the pupa and the adult butterfly each of the four stages very unique to individual species of butterflies which is a part of what makes watching and raising butterflies so much fun first stage egg stage the egg stage usually lasts 3 to 7 days but this can vary quite a bit among different species of butterflies so the egg is sticky and it is laid on the bottom of a milk with plant leaf and it hatches in a few days next stage is caterpillar stage a very tiny caterpillar hatches out from the egg the first meal for most of the caterpillar is the egg shell the caterpillar is designed to be an eating machine and before it begins to be a pupa it will increase its body mass thousands of time the picture shows a small young green and black larva and the larva or caterpillar eats the egg shell and then the milkweed leaves and the larva molds or shed its skin about 5 times next stage is pupa stage you can see it has made a silk mate and attached it itself at the base the caterpillar also spun a string of silk around its body and attached the string to the branch to hold that pupa in the place in the same way actually the majority of butterflies will hang upside down from their silk pad then last stage is adult butterfly stage a butterfly has three main parts head thorax and abdomen and the life span of most adult butterfly is about 2 to 3 weeks but this can vary greatly among some species now let's understand animals that give birth to young ones some animals do not lay eggs and they reproduce by giving birth to young ones that feed on their mother's milk mammals are example of such animals so let's understand about mammals mammals have very well developed brains most mammals have hair on their body human beings along with dog 
cat, lion, elephant, deer, cow, buffalo, hippopotamus, zebra, giraffe, monkey and rabbit are some example of mammals. And whales and dolphin are mammals found in water but they do not have hair on their body. And most mammals live on land and breathe through lungs. But do you know how a whale or a dolphin breathe? Whales and dolphin also breathe through lungs. They take in air through blow holes which are present on the top of their heads and hence they have to come to the surface of water frequently to breathe in air. Now let's understand write one word for the following. First T H E T A B I L I T Y ability T O 2 P R O D U C E produce M O R E more O F of T H E I R there O W N own K I N D kind. So the question is the ability to produce more of their own kind. Answer is R E P R O D U C T I O N reproduction and an animals reproduce by two methods laying eggs and giving birth to young ones now next v a r i o u s various s t a g e s stages o f of D E V E L O P M E N T development F R O M from A N N E M B R Y O embryo T O 2 A M A T U R E mature A D U L T Adult I N N T H E the L I F E life O F of A N N A N I M A L animal various stages of development from an embryo to a mature adult in the life of an animal. Answer is L I F E life C Y C L E cycle life cycle. Now next A C O M P L E T E complete C H A N G E change F R O M from a Y O U N G Young F O R M Form T O 2 A N N A D U L T Adult F O R M Form So the question is a complete change from a young form to an adult form. Answer is M E T A M O R P H O S I S metamorphosis. Frog and butterfly both undergoes several changes before it becomes an adult, which is called metamorphosis. Now next T H E the P R O C E double S process O F of 
एस एच ई डबल डी आई एन जी शेडिंग टी एच ई द ओ एल डी ओल्ड एस के आई एन स्किन बी वाई बाय ए एन एन ए एन आई एम ए एल एनिमल सो द क्वेश्चन इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ शेडिंग द ओल्ड स्किन बाय एन एनिमल आंसर इज एम ओ यू एल टी आई एन जी मोल्टिंग इवन बटरफ्लाई शेड्स द ओल्ड स्किन इन लाइफ साइकल नाउ नेक्स्ट ए एन I M A L S animals T H A T that R E P R O D U C E reproduce B Y B Y G I V I N G giving B I R T H birth T O two Y O U N G young O N E S once W H O who F W E D feed O N on T H E I R there M O T H E R apostrophe S mothers M I L K milk answer is M A L M A L S mammals which are animal that reproduce by giving a birth to young ones and who feed on their mother's milk now let's understand right two example for each of the following first e double g egg l a y i n g laying a n i m a l s animal so the question is egg laying animals answer b i r d s birds f r o g frog so as you know many animals reproduce by laying eggs and birds and frog also reproduce by laying eggs next question a n i m a l s animals t h a t that u n d e r g o undergo m e t a m o r p h o s i s metamorphosis so the question is animals that undergo metamorphosis answer is f r o g frog b u d t e r f l y butterfly so frog and butterfly are example of animals that undergo metamorphosis they undergoes several changes before they become an adult now next question a n i m a l s animals t h a t that g i v e give b i r t h birth t o 2 y o u n g young o n e s one animals that give birth to young ones so the answer is h u m a n human b e i n g s beings human beings and second example is c a t cat so as you know some animals do not lay eggs and they reproduce by giving birth to young ones and human beings and cat are example of 
animals that give birth to young ones now next m a w m a l s mammals human beings along with dog cat lion elephant cow buffalo hippopotamus zebra giraffe monkey and rabbit are some example of mammal so here answer is h u m a n human b e i n g s being human beings and second example is c a t cat so as you know that mammals are example of such animals which do not lay eggs and they reproduce by giving birth to young ones that feed on their mother's milk so here example of mammals are human beings and cat now next question m a w m a l s mammals f o u n d found i n in w a t e r water mammals found in water answer is d o l p h i n dolphin w h a l e whale so as you know most mammals live on land but whales and dolphins are example of mammals found in water but they do not have hair on their body like other mammals whales and dolphin breathe through their lungs and they take in air through blow holes which are present on the top of their hands so they have to come to the surface of water frequently to breathe in air so today we have learned that many animals reproduce by laying eggs the eggs are either kept in a warm place or the parent animal sit on them to keep the eggs warm animals that lay eggs include birds frog fish bee mosquito butterfly and grasshopper then we have learned about life cycle of egg laying animals first is a life cycle of hen the mother hen lays egg in her nest and sits on them to keep them warm and this helps the embryo to develop better and faster once the embryo within the egg has developed into a chick the chick breaks the shell to come out and this is called hatching then the young chick then grows up to become an adult then we have learned about animals that give birth to young one so some animals do not lay eggs they reproduce by giving birth to young ones that feed on their mother's milk mammals are example of such animals so human beings along with dog cat lion elephant cow buffalo hippopotamus rabbit are some example of mammals